Kumari, you're right. I am very overwhelmed by the amount of stuff I have and I do not want to have this much paper. Hello, I am back again and today I'm gonna go through Oof, I got exhausted just by starting that sentence. Uh, I'm gonna go through all the papers I have laying around. It feels as though I have more paper than the average person. Uh, probably because I do have a lot of notebooks and diaries and papers for crafts and letters and, you know, postcards, um, notes drawings a lot of drawings and also i used to write a lot when i was a kid so i have a few things that's handwritten um also i printed the pages because the computer back back in the old days was so slow that you would rather just print it and read it than to try and scroll through some lagging word document just me i don't know um so yeah i'm gonna <laughs> print all the papers that are um about me or that I own or that I have created or you know and I'm gonna bring them and put them back there and it's probably gonna be a mountain I did did do um, somewhat the same a few weeks ago but I didn't bring out all the papers and also that was just to get started and see how much I actually have which was a lot um, so yeah before I regret it all let's just start and jump right in Can one person accumulate this much? And I am, you know, I am only two decades old, so. Now the reason I want to downsize, well, I feel like there are some obvious reasons. And then it's more that I want it to be easy to move around because I do not want my possessions to be the reason that I cannot do things. You know, there's so many other reasons why things wouldn't work out. So my possessions are not gonna be one of them. So yeah. Um, and also it feels really liberating. Uh, just like letting things go, allowing myself to just like move on. Sounds so dramatic, but it feels so good. So let's do this. It's gonna probably take a few hours. I'm gonna move into some other place. I could actually stay warm if I put this thing on fire, you know, we wouldn't have to pay it for heating the whole winter um, <laughs> because there's so much. Uh, but then again, it's so hard to differ between what I do actually want to keep and what I don't want to keep. You, my whole life story is right here. I also found a lot of photos from when I was five and I didn't know those photos existed. And if I had to grab anything right now, if the house started to, you know, if there was a fire, I would grab those. I don't know, this was really emotionally draining. Like when I redid my whole room, I was like, this was a bad idea but then I knew if I just like kept going kept going kept going eventually I will get there you know it's not you're not going backwards so right now if I'm just like if I go through it and I just throw out as 
much as I can. If this thing means as much as I say, like the drawings that I can just throw out, then I will go through the process of scanning them, you know. And then if I'm like, I don't want to, I'm like, okay, so why do you keep them at all? <laughs> I just gotta play that game with myself. And I have, you know, I mastered Tetris because when I took out everything, the first time I read it in my room and I took out like half of everything, the living room was full. Um, so how I managed to stack all this everywhere, amazing. Hire me. I just really want to do this and I, I know I am not going to manage to downsize to the amount I want today. I know that. I, I know that from for the cluttering my clothes, for example. It takes many rounds because you slowly, you get your values right and then you are more sure about what you actually want to keep and what you don't want anymore. Because now I'm just like, maybe, 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 maybe. And you know the hell yes, hell no? Maybe after a while, but not in the beginning, because then you, you really just don't know. I am nauseous. Um, and I don't want possessions to do that. So... It's a very full folder of drawings. Right now I'm having really decision fatigue, so uh, let's go do it tomorrow.